The new sky replacement effect. Today's video is sponsored by The Grinch. Open your clip in the color page. Go to the magic mask window, activate the toggle mask overlay, draw a line into the sky, change the quality to better and hit the track forward button. Once your mask is ready, add another node and connect the blue dots. Search for the sky replacement effect and drag it to the second node. You can refine the mask if you need to. Scroll down to the artificial sky menu and increase the sky opacity all the way. You can set a color for your new sky if you want. Adjust the horizon softness and height slider to your liking. Increase the cloud opacity slider all the way and adjust the cloud sliders to your liking. You can use the cloud time slider to move your clouds, activate the keyframe button and animate the slider if you want to animate your clouds. The sky looks nice, but if you have some movement in your shot, then it will look fake. Just simply click in the track foreground button and it will do the hard work for you. Click to the auto size for motion button and you'll have a nice track new sky just with two clicks. If you want you can scroll down and activate the adjust foreground box, set it to match horizon and adjust the sliders to your liking. Of course this is only available in the studio version, but sometimes in life you have to pay also. Speaking about money, if you want to support me, don't you even think to buy me a beer. If you like this clip, subscribe to this channel. If you didn't, just give me your money and go away.